Hi, my name is Elaine Osborne, and I would like to start off by thanking PCI for funding this grant, and we are teachers for providing a website for teachers, um, allowing teachers to interact with each other and share ideas. Um, I created gripping boards. I teach an active learning classroom, which is a developmental classroom. My students have multiple disabilities. All of them have some type of motor planning, dyspraxia, cerebral palsy, um, neurological issues uh, with, with motor planning and motor control. So we work every day on uh, fine motor and gross motor skills, particularly grasping and gripping. So I created these gripping boards that not only will work with on the skill of gripping and grasping and um, planning their motor uh, actions, but also will open the world to them because we can discuss different activities, we can discuss stories as they are working on their grasping and, and gripping uh, skills. Like this one is about cooking. And my student could grasp the whisk off of the board, and then we would talk about how this was for whisking. Um, and they would experiment and explore with the, the actual whisk itself. And we put it into action by whisking something. Um, this is for flipping, for measuring. We just go through whatever the student would grab, or I direct him to grasp. We would then talk about that object. We have a number of boards, of theme boards. This is the musical board, which is everyone's favorite. We have story boards where we talk about the story, read the story, and either read the story and grasp, or read the story and then grasp the items off the board um, and replaying the story. I have several students who have um, visual impairments or cortical vision impairments, CBI, and so I created um, a board that is a CBI board, which has higher contrast, the white and the red, um, enabling them to see the objects a little bit better. And it's the same, again, the same issue. We also have a gripping board for students that need to work on depth perception and um, just, again, grasping, practicing that. So I have included a few uh, videos of my students actually using these boards. Thank you very much. Good, Brandon. You got the string. Grab, good grabbing. Oh, you want to get something else? That string's kind of caught on our fingers. <laughs> Oops, there we go. Grab this. Good. Nice. This is a makes a whistle. Good. Hold it. Hold. Okay, Brandon. We're going to talk about musical instruments now. These are our musical instruments. Can you grab one off the board? Put it 
tray. Good, in our tray. Still holding it? Do it again. Good. Okay, in our tray. Let's get the next thing. What's the next thing? Okay, Danny, we're going to work on our gripping board. Here's the gripping board. Good. Pull it. Good job. Can you pull it? You need some help? <laughs> pull. Whoa. There you go. Pull. Okay. Go for Merlin. There you go. Let's try Merlin again. That's good. Pull the necklace. You got it! That's the magical necklace. Good job. Good job. Okay. I'll take it. Okay. Let's keep pulling. Good job. You got the Queen Guinevere. Nice job. Okay. Now what's the next one? Danny. There it is, the bracelet. Try again. Hey. What about Merlin? Thank mm -hmm. you. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm.